This is the brand new Paradox Rift Elite Trainer Box Iron Valiant version. Now we've opened the Roaring Moon version and had pretty good success. But will the Iron Valiant version be able to compete? <laughs> Alright, so here she is. The Iron Valiant version of the Paradox Rift. This is my last ETB of the year until Paldean Fates comes out. I didn't get to pre-order one, or I haven't yet. <clears throat> Especially not the one from the Pokemon Center, but... This will at least get me caught up for the year until, because this is the fourth quarter, everything's going so fast, there's literally something new every single day. Now what I'm hoping for out of this one is uh, for it to be just as good as the last one, the Roaring Moon version. We actually ended up pulling that alternate artwork, the Glossopod, which was incredible. Like I did not think that we would be able to pull that out of uh, ETB, especially with how the pull rates were already coming out anyway. Here's our promo card. We'll wait on that for one second. All right, let's see what else we got. We got our, in excuse me, energies. Here's our sleeves. Nice, love the Iron Valiant. I actually don't know which one I like better. If I like the Roaring Moon or the Iron Valiant better, probably leaning t more towards the Iron Valiant because it's, I don't know. I'm, I'm a big fan of pink. Maybe that's what it is. I don't know. Let me know what you think. What What's your favorite, Iron Valiant or Roaring Moon? All right, then we got our countermeasures. Our die, piece of resistance, our packs. Nine of these bad boys. All right, let's get it. Let's get started on Paradox Rift. Still got a binder going for it. Still in the works, not gonna lie. Uh, I haven't opened up a whole lot of Paradox Rift, not since the last, oh good. Since the last ETV. Every now and then I'll open up some singles or some blisters or something, but actually not a whole lot here lately, but Maybe this one will give us a better uh, foot up on finishing our... I don't even know what I'm saying right now. I'm trying to sound smarticles and it's not working. Good, and now I'm skipping cards. Techno Radio. And I'm sick. And I sound like garbage. Woshin. Hollow. And I completely forgot about the promo card. I don't know what's wrong with me. I, <laughs> I don't know if like I'm that sick to where like my brain just doesn't function correctly. Something is wrong, but let's open this up real quick. I don't want to... There we go. This will be another promo card that we haven't gotten yet for the Paradox Rift. And I'm reminded of how bad they really are. Look at the centering. It's a little off left to right. And I think there's a little bit of schmuck up there at the top. You can see the white right there. That's okay. Let's take a look. The Iron Bundle Black Star promo. That's, I mean, it's a sick card. I actually think I like the Screamtail better, but this is a very, I mean, it's a very unique card. I like it a lot. And like I was saying before, I am a little under the weather, so I apologize for my, my Darth Vader tone right now. Um, I definitely don't have what it's, What's I can't I should I even be doing this right now? Like should, should I be I feel like I it almost makes me sound like I smoke oh my god like 30 packs a day. And I don't I'm not a smoker, so I don't know what's going on. It's just it's that time of the year, I guess. I don't know. But here we go. Good get it together, Pudge. Alright, let's go. We got Foy Coco, Blip Bug, Snow Runt, oh my god, Honage, Toad Squirrel. Slitherwing, Devolution, Kimigu, Cyclozar. Ooh, there we go. The Iron Valiant EX. Cool. All right, let's let's just let's all take a deep breath, focus up. We are fine. Everything is fine. I hate these packs. Everything about them. How is it ripping from the front? That doesn't even make sense. Just throwing. All physics outside the window. Okay, here we go. All right, Flittle, got Nicket, Knackley, Nimble, or Beetle, Cloth, Jury's Cape, Striker, Crustle, and the Gar. Yeah, the that guy. Maybe I need a nap or something. Cause now I'm like. Because of all the screw-ups I've already had this, this video. Oh, okay, there we go. That'll light me up a little bit. Thank you. Thank you there, soft back. Quick rip. Love it. I'm starting to feel a little cranky there. Maybe. 
Maybe Pug needs a nap. I don't, I don't know. Something's wrong. Alright, we got Charcadet, Tatsukiri, Mdozo, Tulip, Minfu, Blitzel, Cofagrigus EX, and Yokoko. Alright, nothing big yet. Our goal is to try and get another Halt Art like we did from the first. I'm gonna lose it. I don't know how people do this. I really don't. I don't know how. Like, if you watch Pokey Rev, how he does it with ease, the man can go through. No matter what pack or series it is, he can go through 10 of them in like less than 30 seconds. And I don't I don't get it. I don't understand. I'm not that gifted. Which he has been opening them up for years longer than I have. But I figured I would have had it down by now. I guess not. Cedra. Dublade. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Excuse me. The Tulip Full Art. It's not the alternate art, but it's the full art. And we'll take it. Love it. Old Tulip had me all choked up and stuff. I don't know. <laughs> I don't. I couldn't talk. Sorry. I don't know if she's the waifu card or whatever they call it. I don't know if that if she's the one. But it's a beautiful little card. Like I said, it's not the alt art. It's just the full art. But it will take it. It's definitely going in the binder because we need it. So let's see what we get next. Still searching for an alt art. Let's go. Swablu, Panseer, Wiglet, Flygar. Veluza, Chantel, Garbodor, Glycer, Coco, and the more Peko Hollow. So, it looks like Taldean Fates is going to be pretty popular. Not going to lie. Still not a big fan of the name, but it should be out soon. Uh, there were plenty of opportunities to pre-order it. I know the ETBs coming straight from Pokemon Center were going to be exclusive. I was not fast enough uh they went really fast but i'm looking forward to seeing what the rest of the products look like palki aha but it'll have a couple of reprints from different series uh it'll have so many shinies i think it's gonna have like 18 18 baby shinies alone and then of course the full art shinies as well it's gonna be a pretty popular set it's going to it's gonna be huge no matter how bad the name is well, we won't talk about that. We'll just get ready for it and wait for it to get here. Play Coco, Flipbug, Snow Runt, Honage, Future Booster, Screen Tail, Iron. What are the odds of that? Screen Tail and the Iron Bundle, the two promo cards from the ETBs back to back. That's pretty cool. I don't know if anyone else caught that or cares. The Iron Moth. And yeah, with that being said. Paradox Rift will soon become a thing of the past. I, I was, I was really hyped for this set, and I got, I got kind of let down. Not gonna lie, this makes no sense. Who, who seals these? Who si Is it Elmer's glue, like, or Gorilla glue? Ridiculous how they seal it. I try my best not to bend the freaking cards. Okay, all right, Magby. Last pack of magic. Can we get that alternate artwork of any kind? Can we get at least one more hit? Brute Bonnet. Exploud. There's the Mewtwo EX. And that's going to be our last hit of the ETB. All right, well, that's going to do it for this one. No alt art, but we did get that sweet tulip full art. We'll take it. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, smash that like button. Subscribe with the notification bell on. Let me know down in the comments what you'd like to see me open next. Thank you for joining my Pokemon journey. And remember, this is only the beginning. See ya!